Using Hess's law, we're going to use Hess's law to calculate the enthalpy change of the following reaction, which has tungsten oxide, some hydrogen, giving us some tungsten and water. And we're going to use these two equations to build that. All right. Now, we will be able to build it out of all the equations that are provided. I'm not going to give you extra, I'm not going to give you too few. So we are going to be able to use those. So what we're going to do is find our reagents in these two equations down here and get try to balance out the equation. All right, so the first one I'm looking for is the tungsten oxide. And I'm going to call this one here equation one. And it's in equation one. And I see that I need to take that equation one and multiply all the coefficients by one half. So I get just one tungsten trioxide. I also need to reverse it. And that's what I'm going to do. So I have just tungsten oxide. But on the product side, I'd have just a single tungsten and three halves of an O2 gas. All right, also going to do the same thing to get the H2, the hydrogen. And I want three of them, but equation two has two of them. So I'm going to take equation two and multiply by three and divide by two. Multiply by what I want, divide by what I have. And that would give me three hydrogens and three halves of an O2. I'll make sure I put phases there because sometimes those change and this will be just three waters. And if we look at this, our oxygens would cancel out if we added those two equations together. So we have the same reactants in the overall equation we want to build and the same products. So we can combine these equations. So what I'm gonna do is to these values, that one will get multiplied by one half and I'll flip the sign to make it reversed. And this one here is gonna be multiplied by three halves, but the sign won't change. All right, so and I'm gonna do all that in the calculator. So 1685.4 times one half minus, because that 477, 477.84 times one and a half is three halves. And I get an answer of positive 125, and I think it was point, was it point nine four? Nine four. But I'd only have nine because that's digit and it would be kilojoules. So positive 125. 